Hurricane Milton isn't just a life-threatening monster for Florida. It's an unusual, but not unheard of, freak of nature storm. It was born in the Bay of Campeche in far southwestern Gulf of Mexico. Most Gulf of Mexico storms go north or north and west. Milton is going northeast, which is unusual, but it's not unheard of. Other storms have done this in the past, but it is an unusual path. But what about the strength? That's what's really strange here because Hurricane Milton hit the top of the scale for hurricanes category five, not once, but twice. It even hit 180 miles per hour once. Why? It's fueled by this extreme warm water in the Gulf of Mexico. So why is the water so warm? One of the main reasons here is climate change. Human-caused climate change has warmed up the waters everywhere, but the waters of the Gulf, the Caribbean, and the Atlantic have been at near record levels for a year and a half. Milton is dangerous for another reason, because of where it's going and where it might go. If it hits Tampa Bay, that's sometimes one of the worst case scenarios the scientists have worried about. That's because Tampa Bay has not had a major hurricane directly hitting it in more than 100 years. 